Hey y'all, it's me, Curly K Glam, and I'm here today to give you another video. So I know this is um, a weird kind of setup, but just excuse the background noise here. That is the dryer I'm doing laundry. I dread doing laundry, but anyway, this is my final review on this hair because I'm about to take this style out. I'm just going to say it's been two weeks because by the time you I post this video, it will have been two weeks. And I'm just, you know, a few days shy of the two weeks. I'm about to take this hair out. Um, Let me just start by saying I'm taking this hair out a couple of days premature because my scalp has been itching horribly. And I think it's because of the hair. This is the first time this has happened to me because typically I don't get irritated. But um, if you do get irritated... And you did not, you know, pre-treat your hair. Just get a cotton swab. And if you have at home, dab your um cotton swab either in some regular vinegar or some apple cider vinegar. And it will, like, zap the itching right away. Um, Like I told you guys before, um, there's nothing to really do to this hair because this is a, a really low-maintenance hair. Um, What I do daily to maintain it is just, you know... When I'm fluffing it out, if I see any knots, I just take my pair of scissors and just, you know, remove the knots. Um, my ponytail is pretty much unraveling at this point because, you know, it's time to let this go. I'm ready for something new. I'm not sure. I'm stuck between three styles. I either want long colorful box braids, faux locks, or um, jumbo Havana twists. So by the time you see this video... I would have chosen one of the three. I don't know which one, but just stay tuned to my channel because you know I'm going to either do a tutorial on the hair or if it's a crochet style, I will be reviewing the hair because, you know, I just want to help my protect my natural sisters find, you know, low maintenance and easy protective styles they can put in their hair. Especially, you know, if you're taking a break from wigs or you just want to try something new. Um... What else besides this hair? Like I said, I really like this hair. Water Wave is definitely a go-to. If you want a quick, easy pattern that you ain't got to do much to, um, Water Wave is definitely it. Um, if you didn't watch my previous video, I did buy this hair from my local beauty supply store in a color TT30. So that's that. Um, I said I put, oh, and I put, um, what is it? The, um, I put olive oil on my scalp. Just regular olive oil that you can find at your food section in your local grocery store. And Jamaican mango, j black, j mm, mango, <laughs> Jamaican mango and lime. The the mentholated um, braid spray. That's like one of the best sprays. And it, of course, it tingles your scalp. I put that on my hair every day to help minimize the itching. But um. Yes, y'all. I'm ready to take this out. I'm ready to dunk my head in some water, get some conditioner on this head, and prepare for my next style. Um, I know this is going to be quick. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm holding the camera with my hand. I know this is going to be a quick video, which is something um, that's not really, that doesn't really happen on my channel because I like to ramble. But, um, yes, I didn't have a particular night time routine for this hair. I just rolled my hair up in the back like this and put my bonnet on and that was that take my bonnet off in the morning um i would put some wet and wavy spray on it from time to time and just shake it out fluff it out and go it's the easiest hair you can have but don't forget to rate comment and subscribe share this video like this video and don't forget to follow me on instagram at curly cake glam and on twitter at curly cake glam and i'll be back with more videos Deuces.